she is. Hi mom. Hi. <laughs> and that's our bro Alton. What's up guys? New hairstyle today. He changes his hairstyle every day. Oh, that's good. Well, that's, that's how we roll. <laughs> Had such a good time last night with the uh, Bri. And guys, I had such an amazing sleep, man. Wow, wow, this place is so tranquil. As I said, we are like 200 meters from the beach. There's the pathway. But this morning, we're gonna make our way down to the city center, or the little center that they've got out here with all the uh, restaurants and the shops and uh, the hotels and there's also a cool theater out there that I want to show you a uh, very famous theater out here on the west coast so um, we want to check that out this morning maybe grab a coffee at one of the coffee shops on the waterfront and uh, then there's the nice beach area so yesterday we went to Paternoster Beach which is kind of this whole little coast down here it's called Paternoster Beach uh, there's a little cove and then it just carries on to the other side where there's also a um, nature reserve, the Paternoster Nature Reserve. Alright, we've arrived at the Paternoster waterfront. Uh, so we had to park on the outside. Alright, let's check it out and see what they have you got. This here cut restaurant. My naked. So you can do kayaking here as well. Kaya troops. Mm -hmm. The art shed. Go check that out right now. There's a nice coffee shop here, guys, called Kukuma Kranka. Right, I don't know what that means, but it's got a cool name. One Krifta Hang. Or Krifta Gang. Restaurant and oyster bar. Cool. Whales, rib. And this is what I wanted to check out. Very famous theatre out here on the west coast. Cool Kamas Theater. Well, I guess if you're gonna translate that, it's the Cool Rooms Theater. And just to give an idea of some of the recent uh, shows that's been taking place. All right. I'm not sure if I can go inside, guys, but I'm gonna ask. Uh, this is the foyer area, I guess. Just ask for permission to film. Oh wow! Look at this, guys. That's the stage area, and that is for the audience. It's like a lounge vibe. Wow, this is amazing. This is stunning. Just imagine the vibe that must be in here, man, and the acoustics. And of course, a little bar area. Not sure if they sell any food out here. Wow. Awesome. Uh, I'm not sure if you can read that. Kaya trips, and that's the number. I'm gonna have the the number in the description as well. So if you guys are interested, just check out that number also it's called kayak patanosto wow man ah there they are they just left a few minutes ago i'm 
I'm gonna have to check out that water guys uh, I would imagine that it's very cold this is the South Atlantic Ocean and knowing the Atlantic Ocean it's very cold especially on the Cape Town side All right, so we're going into the arch here. Hello. This must be an old pulley system because uh, this seems to be like a jetty or an old jetty. If you know anything about this, please comment down below and let me know. That's Patanosta Beach over there and you see that rock formation on that side? That's where we were yesterday. And we're probably gonna go to that beach immediately after this. See a cat restaurant. Describe a time and the last one. I'm not going to film inside. But yeah, it is a uh, clothing store, you know, for like swimwear, island style really, colors, corals and yeah, journey, I think another clothing store and the glass art studio or the glass art studio gallery. Okay. Parlor. to mention there's uh, e-bikes that you can hire I'm not sure if it's for the day or for a uh, limited amount of time but I can imagine that you would need an app for that as well which I suppose you can just download some nice uh, lookout spots and uh, seating to check out this view That's the waterfront where we just came from. And that's where we want to go. So I think I'm going to go down to that parking out that on that side. Go down that road. And then maybe we'll make our way down this beach. Yeah, and check out that water as well. I see some people swimming, so uh, maybe it's not that bad. Kathy's Kitchen 
and there's Blicky Pizzeria and Patanosa Lodge so there's so many accommodation out here in Patanosa I don't think there's a shortage but you can also see that it's quite busy and I see a lot of tourists or a lot of holiday makers out here so yeah I found my accommodation quite easily and there were quite a few others as well that were available but I chose the one that I chose Lifeguards on the beach, that is cool and I suppose these are the designated swimming spots in between the flags. The sun seems a bit bright and bright on these um, on the sand as well. Hey doggy! Just ignoring me man, how rude. Time to test that water. Right guys, I've got the flip-flops. I don't have my swim shorts, but I'm going to get it later. But let's just check the water first. Time to kick those babies. And the moment of truth. Here's my friend. What's up guys? It's cold guys, but I gotta say it's not freezing cold as I expected. Okay, I'm feeling it now. <laughs> wow, what are you detecting? Anything. Oh, anything. It's not like mussels or anything. Crayfish. No, mussels. Oh, it catches crayfish. Crayfish, wow. No. <laughs> no. <laughs> Pick up something. Hey buddy. <laughs> so that was a one rand coin that we detected and so it is a metal detector. That's my mom y'all. Alright. So now you can see where the crazy comes from. Alright guys, so I mean this place is something else man the water is beautiful um, it's a beautiful day but we have a bit of mist or fog and you can't see that clearly but wow what a stunning beach and it goes all the way around all the way to the other side got a little homemade but floating device <laughs> got the bottles and styrofoam yeah man go guys <laughs> that is so cool Ah, 
guys. Unfortunately, we had a shipwreck. These are the remains. Just picking up the pieces now. Oh, they're gonna try again. <laughs> These guys are survivors, man. <laughs> Gotta hand it to them, they've got determination and endurance. Just wanna see what they've got. It's a mobile coffee trader. Oh, a coffee truck. So we're at this area now and this seems to be like, well it looks like an old fish market. You can see the setup. Where they used to clean the fish. But I think these days they use it as a uh, little market area. Where various vendors come and do their pop-up stores and markets and they sell all these gifts, curios, items. There's also a food store on that side, a food store, and there's also takeaways on that side. A restaurant called Haiki. It's right on the beachfront, and as you can see, it's like they've got a private beach out here as well. Ah, oh, there's a little rock formation, rock pool. Right, Patanusta wine and tasting lounge. Nice. There's a boho beach shop, towels, jewelry, bikinis. Baskets, okay. There's a Benguana Blue restaurant. Seafood platter. Nice. Saggy stone. Oh, it's the Akwata Art Gallery. I'm not gonna go inside, guys. I don't wanna film the art. Doggies, the drinking post. It works, but that can't be right. It's not starting on zero. <laughs> I'm not saying the same. Oh, this one's probably starting on zero. So that's the trading post. Um, you don't want to form inside there, but it's like a general store, you know, it just sells everything. Toys. Uh, shades, clothing, hats, electrical stuff, um, shoes, um, you know, like beach attire and so forth. And I think they have coffee inside as well.
Sapjira at Mikasa, Sukasa. Oh no, that's not the name. The name is Trattoria, but it was a family restaurant. All right, my home, your home. Uh, there's so many art galleries out here, guys. Here's another one, Ruben Art. All right, so we're gonna just stop here for a drink. We have enough food at home still from the leftovers of the braai last night. So we're just gonna stop for a, maybe like a drink, milkshake, or coffee or something. Alright, that's where we came from, Paternoster Hotel. I've been to the Stonefish studio earlier. Hey, to this mom's milkshake, guys. Right? Vanilla milkshake, right? Vanilla milkshake. Vanilla milkshake, and Alvin's got a cappuccino. Here we go. How's that? Mm. Doing it for you. <laughs> Very good. <laughs> no yep. sugar, no sugar. Right. And then I'm having a cappuccino as well. All right, so we're taking the warm stuff because uh, there's no juice available. And, uh, we didn't want to go for gas either, so... Mm. Okay. But no. Oh. Mm. Mm. <laughs> taking a shortcut through the bush to get to the beach. Alrighty, here we go. Made it. <laughs> ah, we just didn't feel like driving. So now we're just gonna follow that path and I will take us all the way to the beach. That's our guest house. This one. You see it? That one, that one, that one. <laughs> Now stop at a restaurant called Four Strand, and this one is right on the beach. So we're just gonna check out what they have. It comes highly recommended. Well, I think these are all guest houses, and uh, this is this restaurant is really close to where we're staying. So it's about it would be about five minute walk. We came here by car because we're on our way somewhere else. But let's check it out. Four Strand restaurant. It's very nice. This is the uh, foyer, the entry, the entrance foyer. Hello. Yes. Oh, it's right on the beach. Oh. That's the view you have from Full Strand. 
Yeah. And yeah. something to drink? Uh, semi sweet. Semi sweet. There we go. There we go. <laughs> It's not gonna go for that. It's not gonna go for that. <laughs> <laughs> cool. Okay, so, uh, Mama and Halton both went for the first round burger. It's like a beef burger, a beef patty, with chips. And I went for the calamari strips. It just felt like something fishy, <laughs> something seafood, at least. So, yeah. Thank you.